All right, today's going to be great, but after today we're, we'll start to see some changes heading our way. Rain moves in tomorrow. Light rain, but nonetheless a chance for that precip on your Wednesday. After that, cools down late this week, and then Christmas week has the potential to be pretty active starting on Christmas Day, continuing uh, a few days after that. So we'll touch more on that in a moment. Right now it's a beautiful start to the day, 32 in the metro, feeling like 25. Uh, we're going to have a bit of a breeze out there from the south today, so wind chill might be a, a bit of an issue, but still it's going to be pretty nice for mid-December. 29 in Grinnell and 33 already in Fort Dodge this morning. Those temperatures climb to the 40s in uh, northern Iowa and the 50s in Ames, Grinnell, all of southern Iowa looking at 50s as well. So shaping up to be one of the warmest days we've seen in quite some time. All right, so we're quiet today here in Iowa, but there is this cold front around the Pacific Northwest that will be moving our way today and arrives tomorrow. So as that happens, we'll see increasing cloud cover uh, really tonight. I think most of the day today should be pretty sunny, but later on tonight, clouds fill in. Could see some drizzle, maybe some light rain around this time tomorrow morning. Nothing too significant, but just something to keep in mind for that morning drive tomorrow. Uh, during the daytime into Wednesday evening, we could see some sporadic rain showers and then possibly switching over to a little bit of snow in eastern and northeast Iowa Wednesday night into Thursday morning. Really shouldn't see too many impacts with that snow. Uh, the rain's not going to be that impactful either. Most of us staying under a tenth of an inch when it's all said and done. After that, should be quiet on Thursday and Friday as far as precip is concerned, but it will be cooler with highs near 40 both of those days, staying near 40 over the weekend with a slight chance of snow over the weekend. And then early next week, after mostly dry conditions on Christmas Eve, there's a chance we have a pretty busy Christmas day and we'll have plenty more opportunities for rain, snow, or maybe a little bit of both during the middle of next week.